Welcome back to another cleaning video. Today we've got so much to get done. We have the pantry to clean out, wipe out, organize, uh, put things away in there. Um, we also have the fridge we need to clean out. We have to wipe down all the appliances. We are also taking the trash out. We're sweeping and mopping. We're just doing a really good clean in the kitchen. This is uh, my second attempt of cleaning the kitchen. Um, I've I already cleaned the kitchen when I first got home, but this is just kind of a, after being home um, for about two and a half weeks now, you know, you just have to maintain it somehow. And so today we are going to attempt to do that. We've got, like I said, a lot to get done, but this mama needs her coffee. Yes, at 2.45, this mama needs her first cup of coffee. I've actually been working really hard and not having coffee, <clears throat> excuse me, not have, having coffee first thing in the morning because I've ventured down this path of intermittent fasting and I do not like black coffee. I just don't like black coffee. Um, I actually have a nasty joke that goes to that, but we're not going to say it. Um, but I don't like black coffee, but I will have tea in the morning and I have a spiced tea that I drink every single morning. Um, so we're going to get to the energy and the fuel that we need to keep going with the day and getting this kitchen cleaned. As I said, we've got so much to get done. We've got the dishes. We've got wiping down cabinets. And, oh, this is, it's just so, it's just gross. We need to get it, get, we, we need, we need to get it done. So welcome back and welcome if you're new. If you are new, please introduce yourself down below. Let me know where you're watching from. And if you're returning, thank you guys so much for always coming back. Your love and your support just fills my heart with joy and it means so much to me. So I can only assume you are here for some motivation. I can only hope that I will provide that for you. So Let's get into today's video as we focus in the kitchen and getting it clean and yikes, <laughs> sanitizing it. Oh, look, look at my happy, dirty dishes. <laughs> I got that from World Market. It was so cute. I love this thing. So um, anyway, let's get into today's video.
So now that the dishes are pretty much cleaned, I while I was down there getting the soap to wash the dishes, I noticed that it could have, it could use some organization, some some uh, tidying up. So that is what I'm doing. And once I'm done with that, I'm going to focus my energy over onto the cups uh, cabinet. We're going to clean all of that out. Meaning, as I'm putting some dishes away, as you guys can see here, I've got some cups on the table on the counter that needs to get that need to get put away. Um, I will be taking some old cups out. Um, and kind of just focus on which ones I don't use, which ones that I don't care for. Um, rearranging this a little bit just so that there isn't a, a hot mess up here when I open up the cabinets. Um, I can't help it with my kids when they put things back inappropriately, or not inappropriately, but in the wrong space, in the wrong spot. Um, I guess my energy is going to be <laughs> refixing this over and over again as often as I can. So we're going to spend a little bit of time with... Um, arranging the cups and decluttering these cups and getting rid of the cups that I do not use um, and that I don't gravitate to. She's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever She leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make her feel better Make her feel better Then that's where she'll go So now that the cups are all done, I am now going to wipe down the countertops and then I'm going to spend a little time with cleaning the microwave. I ended up putting just a, was a mixing or measuring cup of water um, in the microwave just to kind of loosen all of the gunk that's in there. And then I sprayed it with my palm olive spray uh, that I found at the Dollar Tree. Um, and I actually really like it. Will I go buy another one? Maybe if I just happen to be there, but it's not like my must thing, you know, things that I have to go buy. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and wipe down the countertops and the stove top. But I'm really excited um, that not this year, but I've been saying this for, for, I don't know how long now since we've been uh, cleaning in this kitchen, but these cabinets are old and I can only 
paint them so many times and they're warped they're as old as the house so they're not very attractive when you open up down you know and the the lower cabinets everything is warped and just not cute <laughs> um the previous owners i believe may have had a water leak in here and so yeah we just we we will soon um we're looking at cabinets we're trying to price everything out to see what we can do ourselves or if this is something that we are going to um, have someone else come in and do which we do have someone in mind who's actually helped us on a lot of house projects um, but I'm just I'm excited to go and price some things out and look at some things so if you guys have any any suggestions on where I should go outside of Lowe's because oh my Lanta that place is expensive um, let me know where I should go um, I'm just, I'm really excited to just start looking and pricing out and help, you know, designing, um, with my husband on the layout and what we're going to do differently. If we're going to do the same, um, you know, just, I'm so excited. And obviously this room, when we do it, I'll make sure to take you guys along with me. Talking to myself like someone's gonna respond I'm getting tired of myself cause I don't know what I want But I'm not out here on my, out here on my own Dry your eyes, I'm not even worried But I can't hear the sirens you describe don't be ashamed we can't always leave this place and go where no one knows our names pack your bags we never needed their permission to believe in ourselves so come with me we could spend the weekend doing everything they said we So while cleaning the cabinets, I noticed the grease stain on the ceiling and that's because my kids will cook on high without putting the exhaust fan on. And so I needed to go in and scrub it, but look at what came off the ceiling, you guys. That is just gross. So another reason as to why I cannot wait to get these cabinets done. <clears throat> Repainting the ceiling is gonna be one and obviously just kind of getting down into the nastiness of this kitchen um once the the pan or once all the cabinets are redone i'm going to definitely um repaint the ceiling with a fresh coat of white nothing can hurt us in our bubble for better or worse in an uphill struggle no regrets and windows down
so now I'm going to go into wiping down our appliances and what I'm going to be using is just the e-cloth um, it's the e-cloth appliance where you wet you wipe with one and then you dry with the other and I love how this looks I don't know why I have not been using this more often I've had these for I want to say about a year year and a half and um, I just again I don't know why I haven't been using them but I love the turnout of this it's just zero streaking um, it doesn't leave any residue behind where when you use cleaning products it just leaves a nasty streak or just a, a film or something but um, I'm happy to, to have found them they were actually tucked away um, in the laundry room and while I was in there I'm like oh I need to use these so I brought them out for me to use today so um, now that the appliances are all wiped down we're gonna go ahead and get into the fridge clean everything out yes I'm going to be using my palm oil olive um no i'm sorry i won't be using the palm olive spray i'm actually gonna be using vinegar and water and um wiping down everything getting rid of a few things uh old food um just things that we don't eat anymore or things that have gone bad which if you can see there's hardly anything in there um this was actually done before a grocery uh trip um I, I do a I try to do a big grocery trip on the weekends, but then try to keep up with a few things throughout the week, which has been pricey, I will say. But my our boys are just they're growing and they're always eating, and I just feel like we can never I can never feed them enough. So um, I will be cleaning this out, uh, getting rid of some old food uh, to make room for more food.
So now we're into organizing and cleaning out the pantry. I'm gonna get rid of some cereal boxes while I refill these containers. I'm going to condense uh, oatmeal uh, boxes and all that good jazz. So that is what I'll be doing here while snacking. Um, yep, I snack through this process. So don't, I, I tried to, my, what I was going to do was edit it out. I was gonna cut them out, but that would be cutting out a lot. <laughs> snacked quite a bit and that's the hard part of the pantry because you're like "Ooh, I haven't had that let me try this and you know um, so that is what I'll be doing is uh, organizing all of this condensing a lot of this dusting a lot of this so let's get into the pantry and get this all clean and again I do snack so um, maybe it'll get you to snack on something too I don't know
here we are, the end of the video, and I want to thank you guys so much for being here. 30 minutes, you guys, well, 32 minutes worth of cleaning and hopefully providing you with the motivation that you came here for. Um, I really hope that today's video did that for you, and or if you are new and you enjoyed today's video, that it, it inspired you <laughs> to hit that like button and subscribe button. Also, the notification bell so that you're notified when future uploads are going. And so um, I, I, I'm so thankful and grateful for this community and thankful for you guys uh, for being here and always coming back. I love each of you uh, so much. Um, love chatting with you guys down in the comments. Um, I say this every time, but I do. I really do. I love seeing you guys there. Um, I may not respond right away, but when I do, man, it's such a great feeling to sit there and just chat with you guys. So thank you guys so much for doing that. You guys fill my heart with joy. So we're going to end today's video with um, finishing up with the floors, with mopping, and um, hopefully you guys have a beautiful day or beautiful evening whenever it is that you guys are watching this. I hope again that you guys enjoyed today's video. And um, again, please subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell so you are notified when future uploads are posted. So I will see you guys in the next one. We've got much more coming from Florida. We've got, whoo, I've got so many videos, I will tell you, um, already filmed. I've been batching and I've got backyard. I've got the living room. I've got so much. Oh man. But I hope you guys um, have a beautiful week and a beautiful weekend. And I will see you guys in the next one. Much love and God bless.